Now, Alarak hasn't been released all too long ago, but I've been spending quite a little bit of time to get him to the maximum level, and today, we're gonna be playing this week's co-op mutation mission, obviously on the brutal difficulty. Now, I've heard from people, and I don't exactly know what to expect here, I haven't read the rules yet, but I have heard from people that apparently this week's one is very confusing and very disorientating, whatever that means. And apparently it hurts your eyes or whatever. I guess we find out together exactly what the rules are going to be about. So it's called Flipping Out. Chaos range over the ritual of Rakshir. Enemies are not where they first appear to be and your forces find themselves overcome with fear. Even your own perspective is warped and twisted. Maintain focus long enough for Jinara to win the challenge. Okay, so my own perspective is going to be warped and twisted. I don't really know exactly what that means. Either way, uh, first and foremost, my camera randomly changes positions. Okay. Player units will occasionally stop attacking and run around in fear upon taking damage. Okay. And then we also have got the evasive maneuvers where enemy units teleport a short distance away upon taking damage. Now, I don't have anyone to group up with today, so it's all gonna come down to how good my ally is going to be as well. And by the way, as far as my mastery points go, I decided to go with the combat unit attack speed. Then we've also got the death fleet cooldown as well as the structure overcharge shield and attack speed, which turns out to apparently be ludicrously powerful. Alright, alright, so here goes nothing. Here goes nothing. I'm not entirely sure what to expect. What was that? What was that? My my screen flipped. High Lord or switched. Alarak, an ascendant who remains loyal to Amon has challenged me to Rakshir. We must stand together to crush him. Oh, Psionic support from both you and your ally would make me unbeatable. Declare for me, and we will obliterate this traitor. I I did not ex oh my god, I did not expect it to work this way. Oh my god, I thought it was just gonna like flip my camera to another la random location on the screen. I saw the little black flash earlier, but okay. Oh, uh, this- uh, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> I can totally see why this is going to be a little bit of an annoying brawl. Obviously, we're playing on a brutal difficulty and these are not the only adjustments that have been made to this one, right? It's just gonna get more and more complicated. Okay, well, hey, either way, I think we'll have to try and simply go for a relatively, you know, attack move type of army composition, okay? And what I mean with that is armies that doesn't really, army doesn't really need a whole lot of micro. Because obviously, if I, if I focus really on an army that requires a lot of micro, I may very well make this unnecessarily, oh my god, even putting down buildings is hard. I may make this unnecessarily difficult for myself. Oh, this is so freaking strange. This is so weird. It's because the UI, right? The bottom side of the screen is not actually changing position. It's just the in-game that's actually changing. Anyhow, so I've been playing a lot of Alarak. And Alarak has been treating me very, very well. I've been having an absolute blast. And Wait, where's... Oh my god. How do I... Oh my god, that is so strange. Okay, well, he's been treating me very, very well. I've been having an absolute blast. Is playing him so far. Only one army is offering me support. If you allow me to fail here, they will challenge you next, High Lord. I was I was gonna try and do a bit of a cannon rush type thing, which seemed to work pretty well so far. But I am gonna get messed up, am I not? This is gonna get really messy really fast. A group of enemies seeks to support Amon's champion. Do Ooh, not is this allow normal? that to happen. I think this is normal. Okay, so I got this buff, uh, obviously, on my uh, on my basic attack, which makes it really freaking powerful, and it should help out quite a little bit. Although, my units are moving around all over the place. I can't micro it. Oh, I can't micro this at all. Oh, that is so freaking weird. You know what? I'm going to be focusing on an army based around immortals and, and, and like, other gateway type army units, because I cannot micro at all. I cannot micro anything. Okay, this is gonna take a little bit of getting used to. This is gonna take a little bit of getting used to. It's fine. I wanted to try and take the expansion, which is located over here. I should be able to... Is this the normal screen? No, it's not. This should be relatively straightforward, is what I was gonna say. And generally speaking, we should be okay here. 
What? Do uh... try to stay out of my I am inches away from the pit. Oh no! Oh no 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 no! Get over here quick! Get over here quick! Alarak is back up! Alarak is back up! I'm getting some more units here. What? Where am I supposed to attack though? I can't even say where my army units are at. This is so freaking confusing. I think we're good. I think we got it. I think we're at the very least not dead. All right, all right, all right. I was gonna say, didn't realize that she was so close to being pushed back into the pit. But in the meantime, I have created. What? I have created myself a couple of things. Most importantly, I got Alarak back though. He's really, really freaking powerful. You just need to have him, right? Which helps out a lot. So obviously the supplicants come in in twos. I also want to make sure that I at least get like a, a Havoc or two, which is going to be like the sentry type units that he has. And I gotta be very careful that I don't just randomly like let my stuff die. So far as you can see, this gets very confusing very, very fast. And I gotta be honest, it is going to require a little bit more than what we've got going on, you know, for the time being to complete this one successfully. It's weird because I don't even know anymore what, like, what right side is up. Is this the correct normal view? No, it's not. No, it's not. But the thing is, my units are cowering all over the screen, right? Which makes it very, very, very strange. Either way, time for us to get another Vanguard very soon. Amon's okay, this is the normal greatly screen. enhancing his champion's strengths. They must be eliminated immediately. I gotta have to make sure that I get my expansion out as well. I'm, I'm hoping my ally is gonna join me. Please? Please, sir? Is he... is he joining? Alright, alright, here, this is where we need to go. This is where we need to go. This is so freaking strange! My units are cowering in fear. I'm gonna have to activate just the, as many cooldowns as I can. Alarak himself can mostly clean this up, I'm sure. In the same time, though, I'm gonna try and get my expansion going. Which seems to be working out thus far. Seems to be working out okay so far. And it looks like we have indeed successfully taken care of the uh, distraction that was here earlier. At the very least, all of the things are dead. I've got my vanguards coming in right now as well. And why well, did lose a bunch of my army? We haven't lost. Gonna have to warp it in once again. Now, I was gonna focus today, which is one of the main reasons why I've been leveling up Alarak so much. I was gonna focus on an army based around... Based around the uh, the uh, High Templar version of that army, and it doesn't it doesn't work like this. I I have to micro a lot with that composition, and while it works like an absolute charm, it's already pretty difficult on the normal brutal difficulty, so to say, right? So it's already pretty difficult on the normal version of the brutal uh, brutal missions. So I have to be relatively careful about what I'm doing. I don't know if we're gonna do the bonus objective. I don't think we really need to butter. Although I kind of want to give it a try. I kind of want to give it a try. You know what? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. They're going to be with me for a full minute. It's just that I need to be very careful about what's going on, right? Because... Oh my god, there's actually a lot of stuff here as well. They do a lot of splash damage and they're very, very powerful. What? What just happened? Did that just, like, teleport towards the... Well, that, that's not what I was hoping for. That's not quite what I was hoping for here. I wanted to do the bonus objective. You know what? Instead, I'll just move towards the other uh, the other assignment that we just got. This is so strange. I thought it was just going to flip my camera to random locations on the map. But instead, it's doing this absolutely confusing thing where I have no idea which side is up anymore and which side is, is normal. Alright, we'll get there. We'll get there. Keep on warping in more and more things here. Gotta make sure that I get a big amount of army. Woo! There we go. Tried doing a bonus objective, but I think I'm just gonna stay away for now. And we should be able to deal with this stuff relatively okay now that Alarak is, uh, is going to town on all of the elementals, or all of the hybrids here uh, that, uh, you know, he can be hitting. And we finally... Are we back to normal? No, this is not normal, but it feels okay. This one feels okay at the very least. But so far... It definitely is turning out to be rather difficult. Now, the Havocs that I've got, the sentry type units, as you may know them. Oh my god. Uh, they actually will single out a target and make that target take increased damage. They also give my 
my other army units a little bit more range, which is super helpful. And all in all, I just really need to have like one or two of these Havocs with my army composition. Now, they are pretty expensive and I don't actually fight on their own. So I don't want to get too many. I actually have a couple too many right now. But either way, uh, we'll just keep on producing a couple more um, a couple more vanguards for the time being. And then we'll switch to... Uh, is he actually doing the objective? Oh, yes. I don't know if... Alright, I think he's going to be able to do it just like that. That's pretty sweet. That means that we do get the bonus objective done as well. Although I don't see I don't see my ally currently aiding me here, so you know what? I'm not in a particular rush. Looks like he's got it. Such troublesome creatures. Sure. Slay the last one when you have the chance. I wanted to go ahead and skip it, but now that we are doing one, we may as well do all of it. <laughs> Alright. Um uh, Moving around is so strange. Okay, this is where we need to go. This is where we need to go. This is where we need to go and where we need to be attacking. Whoopsie daisies. Yeah, there's no way I'm gonna be able to micro against this army very easily now, is there? Okay. I'm gonna start making my uh, Colossus as well. Or, they're not called Colossus, they're called Wrath Walkers. They're relatively similar, I guess. And at the same time, I also want to be getting... I also want to be getting these upgrades here. All of my armory's army is cowering about. Gonna need some more pylons, apparently. Oh my god, hotkeys are so important here. Because without them, it's gonna be very difficult to achieve anything. Nearly have my death fleet once more ready to go. We gotta make sure that we start heading towards that bonus objective, though, because otherwise... It's just gonna be a pain. And you know what? I may actually have to add on, like, a second one as well. There we go. Oh no, I already got a second one. Dang, I forget everything that's going on in these type of missions. This is so confusing, but I love it. It's so cool, and yet so weird. The fact is that I can't move about. I need to attack move over here somewhere. Alright, alright. I think we're I think we're fine. I think we're fine. You know what? It's time for me to deploy the death fleet once again. And attack move towards this objective here. Okay. Looks like the army is moving, which is good. You address the These hybrids possess immense psionic power. Okay, here we go, here we go. I found the other objective. Although I think I just got my entire army locked up. Well, not all of it, but a whole lot of it anyway. Alright. Eventually this thing will go down though, which is good. Keep on making more and more uh, units here. I think I'm gonna be able to take care of it at least eventually. All right, all right, here we go. Got my Rage Walkers now as well, which do hit air. Elementals have been eradicated. Now return your full attention to Rakshir. Trying, woman. I'm trying my very best to return my full attention to Rakshir. Okay, I think I'm good. I think I am relatively okay. Trying to warp in more things. But looks like my ally is already moving. So you know what? We'll follow him up that ramp as well. Although, is he? All right, yeah, 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 he is. Yes. Oh my god, this is gonna be a mess, isn't it? Alright, we're popping all cooldowns. You know what? If I don't look at it, I can't mess it up either, you know? See, that's a pretty good way of denying how life works. I'm sacrificing so much of my own army. I've got barely anything left over. Gotta be very careful, because I'm gonna start sacrificing my own raid walkers if I don't. Or if I'm not careful, rather. He really needs to start moving onto the ramp, though, or off of the ramp, though, because there is a lot of army dying here. And while this wasn't an ideal engagement, it looks like we eventually managed to clean it up. But Alarak, basically, when any of my uh, units are available and Alarak falls at low HP, he will immediately take the life of any of those units and therefore uh, get quite a bunch of, uh, a bunch of stuff, but... I think I, I've got a reasonable setup right now. I'm actually, I'll actually get the upgrades right here for Alarak instead for the time being. And get these uh, gateways morphed into warp gates as well. We're gonna have to get back though. Move over towards the, uh, the objective now. This is so confusing! 
move over towards the rock share right now. It's very hard to judge battles, you know? Normally, I can see health bars and at the very right least, they've got like a basic understanding of what's going on. But this is turning out to be an absolute mess. But at the very least, are we pushing the correct direction? Wait, wait, are we pushing? Yeah, we are pushing the correct direction. I thought for a second she was returning to the pit that we were originally leaving from, but nope. Not the case. Okay. Wait, what's attacking us? You are? Oh, there's actually a whole lot of stuff attacking us, apparently. I think we just need to try and max out. If we max out, we're gonna be able to do get a lot of damage in. Either way, you know, I got an army based around attack moving right now. Do I have any sentries? Oh yeah, I got a lot of them actually. It seems Amon's lackeys are moving toward their champion. Intercept them. Okay, here we go. Get uh, these units out as well. And I'm always using the old army hold key, by the way, over here. Which should be fine. Death fleet once again deployed. Okay. Hostile forces are approaching us. Break them. Okay. So hostile forces apparently are gonna approach us. That's fine. That's fine. I don't really mind. Oh. Well, we'll have to join these guys. Hey, would you look at that? We got a normal screen. For how long, though? For how long are we going to be having a normal overview screen? There's a bunch of aggression coming from here, apparently. Well, that's that gone. Warp in more and more army. Okay. Normally, you want to dodge the storms, but you know what? I don't even know where the storms are at and which units are mine, so... Ooh. There's also something over here. Wait, 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 they're attacking my stuff. Why are you guys attacking my things? Here, have a photon overcharge. Or, not a photon overcharge, I guess, but have this thing in your face. Anorak has died, no! Wait, 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 where's my army? No, 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 my army's gone! Where did it go? I had 150 something supply, now it said what? I don't even know where it went. I don't even know where it went. Okay, okay, I gotta rebuild all of this. Or at least if I can, I gotta try my very best to rebuild this thing. I don't think I've lost this mission a single time in my life. That has to be a first time for everything, I suppose, but... Alarak is back, though. Alarak is back. We need to get him into this combat. We've done a lot of work in this mission so far, but... I don't even know what just killed my units. I may have... Like, probably I'm gonna look at this and, and like, analyze it while I'm editing this video, right? I'm gonna look at the... I'm gonna look at the mini-map and I just realize Alarak is just wandering by himself, doing absolutely nothing important. An enemy attack moves towards our base. Oh, most unwise. I wouldn't be surprised if that's the case. So, it looks like we're back at the start, but at the very least we got all of the objectives done. Do we have 2-2 done yet? Yep, we do. That's pretty sweet. Oh, man. No, 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 no! Do not kill my Nexus! Oh my god, it just killed my Nexus. Can you believe that? I was busy aiding my ally. And apparently at the same time... That was not quite good enough here. But I, I should be able, I should be able to at the very least start remaking a bunch of this stuff. You know what? Time for the death fleet. We gotta clean up the shenanigans. We gotta clean up the shenanigans here and I gotta get my economy back in action. Like this, we're not gonna actually make it. How is my ally moving around the map properly? Wait, is he? I don't even know if he is, but the I'm assuming he is. Flows into Amon's champion from the hybrids. Slay them quickly. Generally speaking, this massive psionic power she's talking about doesn't have. Oh no, I think we're dead. This massive psionic power she's talking about, generally speaking, does not happen until you already are on the other side of the map. And I think indeed that that is going to be game over for us. As she will be kicked into the abyss. Alarak, was this your plan all along? You have doomed us all, you fool! Amon will come for you next. I was reading the rules, right? Just a couple of minutes ago, and I didn't think it was going to be that big of a deal. Gotta love that, right? But it... It turns out to be rather difficult. Now, my ally, I'm grouping with the same guy once again. My ally is playing, um, he's playing uh, Swan this time around. Now, not a very common hero, to be completely honest with you. I barely see anyone play Swan ever. 
But we'll see if that maybe works out a little bit better. And uh, if, uh, you know, the big mech ball can't, uh, you know, can actually survive a little while longer. Because my army turns out to be very, very difficult. I wanted to play a micro heavy army. I do not think that that is the correct option. And you know what? I think I'm going to focus on, like, my gateway army first and foremost. And then later on, add on the immortals and, you know, or rather, what are they called? The vanguards as well as the wrath walkers. The uh, immortals and the... Uh, and the colossus. Uh, I think I want to add those on as well, but I'm not going to rush them out, you know? We'll go for upgrades first and foremost, just so my army that I do have actually hopefully stays alive for a little while longer. I do want to finish up... Uh, three three upgrades at some point during this match It will take more than one army's power for me to overcome this challenger high lord. Right. You must both commit your forces to me So I got my uh, I got my structure overcharged. Oh Well, I don't think that's really was necessary. I got my structure overcharged just fine Anyhow Alarak is out Which is good. Hey, is this a normal view? I think it is right. No, it's not I played this game for like far too many hours is what it really comes down to and I don't even know what the normal view is like anymore is this the normal view this is the normal view yep that's the normal view okay trying to bait him back towards my pylon I think I uh, oh no 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 wrong way wrong way where's the uh, the expansion is over there maybe it's the right way well, I do want to make a. Uh... Inches away from the pit. Oh, already. What are you playing at Alarak? Do you want this insurrection to succeed? Uh, we don't really, to be honest with you. It was never our intention to do that. Here, we're here now. There you go. Calm down. Calm down, woman. All right, we'll get these uh, these units out as well. I want to make sure that I get my uh, my Twilight Council right here and basically get all of these upgrades here. You know what? We'll get that one first. We we'll actually chrono boosted out as well, and I also want to be going for the forge, like a single forge at the very least, for now, and maybe add on a second one in a little bit. So hopefully we're going to be able to use that to our advantage as well. So should we uh, should we start moving? We should probably start attacking. Okay, got my expansion going up right now, at a reasonable timing. Come on, please join me, dude. Please join me. Please join me. Please, please, please. Alright, alright, alright. We're gonna need to we're gonna need to kill this. Because otherwise, uh it will absolutely murder everything we got. I'm gonna need uh I'm gonna need my, my gateways here to be morphed in as well. Alarak just died. My entire army is gone. My entire army just got absolutely decimated there. Oh no. I tried! I tried! This is not working. We're not we're not doing this. We're we're gonna we're gonna need to we're gonna need to head back. We're gonna have to kill that hybrid at least at some point here. Alright, Alarak is finally back. I got my death fleet done in a little bit, but I don't have nearly enough army here to clean this up. I'm gonna need more than this. This is already looking really poor. The enemy is providing their champion with psionic support. You must deny him their aid. Okay. We'll try and deny them their aid, okay? We'll try, but... This is turning out to be a little more tricky than I had anticipated. I do have my natural up now, right? Death speak. Oh, the elementals go. of slain may interfere with Rakshir if they wander too close to us. Yeah, Slaughter we'll just skip the bonus. Possible. Skip the bonus! No, 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 no! Oh no, do not throw him in the pit, please! Oh my god, look how close that is to being pushed. Woo! That was not what we had anticipated there. Okay, okay, okay. Like right now, for example, like what am I fighting? Sometimes I see my units attack stuff and I'm not even sure what they are attacking, which is probably not a good indication of what's going on. I'm gonna use my abilities to clean up these hybrids. Of Do not waste my time. Where where are the hybrids again? Oh over here. Okay. Okay, using my cooldowns here to take all of this stuff.
okay. Uh, and at the same time, I want to make sure that I keep on getting these upgrades here as well. So, I need to get all of these. I need to get all of these. I think we got them, right? There we go. There we go. Let's go back. We need to push. So I just want to try and use my abilities on as many of the army units that they have, like the strong ones that they've got. Alaric, what are you doing over there? Very good. It's so weird to aim Alarak's abilities, but you really absolutely have to. He's so freaking powerful. But it's really difficult to like control your army when it's cowering in fear and everything is moving everywhere. Okay. Looks like we're still powering through right now though. We're still powering through and doing work. Okay. There we go. Eliminate them if you have the strength Oh, to I think stay. we I think we're we're doing a good push right now though. Gotta be careful that I don't accidentally wreck my army. Which I've done you know, maybe in the previous one. Maybe accidentally I lost my entire force there, but so far this one is looking far better. Okay. Power is okay. Massive psionic power flows into Amon's champion from the hybrids. Slay them quickly! Uh, got... Got cooldown? I don't know if he has any cooldowns. Uh, I have... In 10 sec. Cooldown. I don't know if he's got any cooldowns. Uh... Alright, 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 let's go. Let's go. Okay, let's go. Trying to do as much damage as I possibly can here. I'm losing quite a lot of army here again as well, but it's not. I'm not sure if that's like because of the engagement. Because macro-wise, I don't think we've been losing all too much yet. And actually, Swan has got an enormous army. Okay, the Death Fleet is ready for deployment. I could use it to get the bonus objective, but you know what? I think I'm okay with skipping out on the 2,000 experience over the 185,000. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna move it right here. Because this is a really big force. I think this is right about where we lost our army previously. So I probably don't want to, you know, recreate that scenario. Uh, not entirely sure what's going on here, but I believe that's a lot of death aim on stuff, which is really the market we're in for here anyway. Okay. Once again, doing a lot of damage, and I think we're getting there. Is this a normal overview? I think it is. Okay. Okay. So now the final, like the final bit, These is going to be those elementals in the back. Power. They are very, very, very powerful. But the issue is I just pulled my cooldowns, right? I just pulled all of my cooldowns out. I'm not sure if he's gotten anything. We can wait. Do we, do we go? I don't know if he wants to go. Oh my god. That was a huge connection there. Alright, fine. Alarak. You lead the charge, my man. Alright, here goes nothing! I think... I don't have any cooldowns right now, but Alarak himself is super powerful as well. We are pushing rather early, and it looks like we've got enough forces here to properly deal with all of this stuff. And while there is still a lot more protos here, we have successfully dealt with the army that was, you know, the scariest part, I suppose. Alright. Empowered him. I empowered him. And I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay. I think that's it. I think, I think we've done it. I think we've done it. It looks like my ally has agreed with me. Man. This is so freaking messy. I got a headache from just this alone. Woo!
Well played. That was cool though. Such a weird one, but so fun, but so strange and so... An impressive display, Howard. Fear not, I have no intention of challenging you myself today. Now, what I really wanted to do was show you a little bit more about what Alarak is all about at the highest level. Because I found out a lot of really cool strategies that have been working very, very well. And while some are very difficult to execute, or at the very least in comparison to some of the strategies and other co-op uh, commanders, I've been having an absolute blast leveling him up, which is the reason why I managed to level him up so quickly as well, I suppose. But either way, uh, we've got a couple more uh, mastery levels, which is pretty sweet. Uh, but if you would like me to make a separate video of all of the cool things that I've discovered on Alarak so far, let me know down below in the comment section of the video. Man, I still see like the screen turning around in front of my eyes right now when I close it. It's absolutely confusing. But anyways... I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you have not already, make sure you hit that like button down below. And if you want to see more, make sure you hit that subscribe button as well. So you get a notification as soon as I upload more. But other than that, I want to thank you all for watching. Have an amazing day. Do not forget to smile. And I will see you in the next one.